notice that at first. Oh my god, guy right here. Oh my god, they're all just. Oh my god. Bro, this AR is crazy! Season 2 of Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2 is finally here, guys. And there's a lot of content to go over. But today's video, we're going to be going over the brand new assault rifle, the ISO Hemlock in Modern Warfare 2. And let me just say, this assault rifle is pretty nasty. It has little to no recoil, pretty good damage range, and just overall damage as well. I was able to max out the gun, get it gold, and I think I have the number one best ISO Hemlock class setup in Modern Warfare 2. And of course, I have an MGB new gameplay with the brand new assault rifle. Before we get into the class setup, if you guys enjoyed the video and find it helpful in any way, shape, or form, it only takes a couple of seconds to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Modern Warfare 2 content, class setups, and much more. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the class setup and the gameplay to follow it up. This thing literally has no recoil. It, and if it does have recoil, it is very, very easy to control. This is a new ISO hemlock, and yes, this is gold camo on it. And just... Did you guys just see that? Hold on. Let's just do it one more time here. This new ISO hemlock is pretty nasty. I was saying it in the video, but I would compare it to like the Scar H and like the Lockman 556 or the Lockman AR that they have in this game. It's pretty nasty. Little to no recoil. And let's go ahead and get into the class setup now. Going over the first attachment, we use the RF Crown 50 muzzle here for the horizontal and vertical recoil control. I was testing this gun out with no attachments, and I noticed this thing has a decent amount of recoil, but then starts to kind of level off at the end. So I think this muzzle is going to be perfect for this weapon, and I think it is great for this weapon. Tuning for that, we gave it a little bit of gun kick control and a little bit of recoil recoil stabilization to help with that recoil next up is the fielder t50 barrel for the damage range bolt velocity hip fire accuracy and recoil control this barrel is going to give us the max damage range and bolt velocity for this weapon and especially on bigger maps like the new i guess it's not really a new map but the museum map this thing's going to be very very helpful on that map and just bigger maps overall i put on no tuning for this barrel but if you wanted to you could turn up the damage range and give it a little bit of recoil steadiness if you think the recoil is a little bit too crazy for you or if you just need way more damage range on this barrel which i think it's already good enough next up we went with this optic this is just personal preference if you feel like an optic you don't really need one um i would say go with maybe like a laser or go with another attachment or like a 45 round mag if you need more ammo for this thing but i personally went with the chrono mini pro i just don't like the iron sights on this gun that's just personal preference next is the stock we went with the arcom s4 stock for the sprint speed aim walking speed crouch movement speed and aim down sight speed just gonna make this gun feel a little bit more mobile because throwing on all the attachments especially the barrel and the muzzle can slow down our movement so so having this is going to be very, very helpful. Tuning for that, we give it a little bit of aim walking speed and a little bit of aim on sight speed to help with that. Last and final attachment is the underbarrel, the FTAC Ripper. This is going to make this gun have little to no recoil. FTAC Ripper 56 underbarrel, aiming idle stability, hip fire accuracy, and recoil stabilization. And of course, the tuning for that, we give it a little bit of aiming idle stability and a little bit of recoil stabilization. And that right there is the full ISO Hemlock class setup here in Modern Warfare 2. I'm going to get into the gameplay. If you guys enjoyed the video and find this video helpful, make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch y'all later. Take care, everybody. All Alrighty, first season two video, and we're using the brand new assault rifle, the ISO Hemlock. And this thing is interesting. Uh, obviously, I got a gold, so I know exactly how this thing really works. It kind of feels like a Scar H and like a Lockman 556 had like a weird baby, and this is what it made. It's 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 the best of both worlds, really hard hitting, easy to control, and uh, we're gonna see if we can uh, drop a nuke with it. We're also back on this map. Isn't this kind of weird? They kind of just like got rid of the map and then brought it back and now it's just here again so yeah gonna be cool to play this map again there's a guy all the way back here i'm gonna chuck a semtex see it feels nice to actually play a different map for once and just different maps overall we got two new maps this season that's my teammate well not new maps this is they're actually all returning maps actually dome obviously a remake and then now we have this map which is coming back yeah this gun is pretty nasty guy running up here just waiting to see if someone was going to come up next to me or behind me oh there's a guy right here dude this thing actually hits really good i like this I wasn't really I wasn't really liking it trying to get it gold, but it's not too bad. Cause I, honestly, I thought it was a, like another Scar H, but it definitely feels a lot different throwing on attachments and actually being able to tune the weapon. Finally died. I'm gonna pop this. Uh, I guess 
Dude, I think they screwed up the map on the, uh, on that, on that streak now. Because the map is, like, all over the place for me now. It's, like, not how it's supposed to be. I don't know, that doesn't make sense, but maybe you guys get me. Where are these guys spawning at? I'm gonna be honest. I, I'm not sure how I feel about this map. They could have honestly left it on. I probably would have been okay, but... Them just bringing it back and not saying anything and not saying the reason why it was actually taken out is just kind of weird. But maybe there's like reasons for it. I'm not too sure, honestly. They got another UAV up. They're getting another UAV up. Oh, they're all going to be back here. I think. One's right here. Got it. Get it done. Yeah, this thing is actually hitting. I don't know what I don't know what I was saying. I don't know. I don't even know how I didn't like this gun before, but this thing's actually hitting now. I'm gonna let him try to capture this. I can't even see him anyways. It's fine. Thing at long range is pretty good too. I approve the long rangeness. Oh yeah, dude, this thing is actually hitting. Once you get the tuning and get all the attachments, I think the tuning is what makes this thing actually kind of hit. And also getting the right barrels too. Once you get the right barrels, it's over. Got another. See, like, why is the map all screwed up like that? I uh, hopefully, hopefully it's not just my game. I don't think it is, but. Oh yeah, this thing is, dude, this thing is crazy. I'm liking this thing. I just need to know where these guys are at now. Oh, well, obviously capturing the HQ, right? Oh, bro had a shotgun ready for me. I just don't want to run out mid and like be an idiot. Now, would it be smart for me to call my advance UAV right now? Yeah, I think it is. Guy's literally right above me. This is like the perfect map to show this gun off in. This is a this is a, a decent long range map. Really wide open, long range. I don't know if I want to. I'm just gonna push this way. I really want to use this UA, the advanced UV as much as I can. So pushing is kind of a, necess, a necessi necessity right now. Can't even speak. Gonna push back a little bit. Oh my god. Okay. She didn't know where these guys are gonna be at. I think they're, I think I just saw a guy up there. I guess not. Oh, there is a guy up here. I don't know what I don't know what that guy was doing. Okay, they captured the uh, HQ. Actually, kind of nice. Now uh, the game can go on a little bit longer, I guess. There's only one guy left, and he's dead now. Okay, let's see where these guys are going to spawn at. I don't play HQ that often. I'm just playing the uh, little mosh pit mode they had. So, I'm, oh my God, I'm healing. Okay, I literally almost died there. Almost, almost sold. I 
just don't know how I don't have this MGB nuke yet. I feel like I got to be like one or two off. Oh my God, that guy had a shotgun ready for my dome. There we go, we got the MGB. MGB with the brand new Hemlock AR. There we freaking go, baby. ISO Hemlock AR, let's freaking go. You know what? I actually now see the resemblance of the ISO from from uh, Modern Warfare 2019. That's actually kind of crazy. I didn't notice that at first. Oh my God. They're all back here, guy right here. Oh my God, they're all just spawning back there. Oh my God. Bro, this AR is crazy. Holy crap. I need to watch the score in case I... Man, we're actually going off. Gonna pop this down there. Pop the UAV. I think we should be fine. The score should run out by the time. Where's this guy at? Is he right here? I'm dead. Finally died. Okay. But they still got to capture it. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, we should be good. I just got to make sure to watch the score and pop the... Uh, pop it when we... Uh, pop the MGB when we can. Yeah, we should be good. All right. We are chilling. Yeah, I really got to watch the score now. Got to watch the score and watch where these guys are spawning at. Try to get a few more kills also. Oh yeah, this thing rips at long range. This thing is so good. Guy running this way. Buddy, where are you going? Where are these guys at? Oh, they're back here still. Yeah, this thing's pretty good. Let me know what, what do you guys think of season two so far. Let me know what your favorite part of season two is. I think I think my favorite part of season two is honestly the new weapons. I like I like using new weapons in this game. It's always just fun to use different guns and level up new weapons and stuff. It's always good. Okay, I gotta watch this. I think I'm gonna call it in honestly when I can. Yep, I'm just gonna probably call it in now. There you go. There is an yeah. Why is the little pad all messed up? It's like zoomed in. Well, anyways, there is the MGB with the brand new assault rifle. If you guys made it this far in the video, drop a like, subscribe to the channel for more Modern Warfare 2 Season 2 content. And there we go, 65 kills, 66, 67, 67 kills with the brand new assault rifle. Again, drop a like and sub if you enjoyed the video. If you like the class setup, I'll catch y'all later. Take care, everybody.